Hey crafty friends, welcome aboard as we reminisce about our unforgettable voyage on the Crafty Cruise Getaway. Kicking off from Jacksonville, Florida, aboard Carnival's Elation, our crafting cruise debut was an absolute blast. Before setting sail, Trish and I caught up with our co-host Brandy from Making It My Own DIY and Kendra from Late Night Creations. Although we knew them virtually, meeting in person felt like reuniting with long-lost sisters. Bright and early on Saturday morning, we gathered at the cruise port. We would like to thank Mary Ellen and her team for making security a breeze. As we climbed those steep ramps, teamwork prevailed. Kendra and Brandy hauled that overloaded wagon, while Kay, Susan, and I carried extra supplies. We'd also like to give a special shout out to Bill, our unsung hero, who took over the wagon and conquered the incline. Once on board, we hustled to the Lido deck to set up our hospitality table and greet our participants. Finally putting faces to the names we had worked with for months was definitely a highlight for us. Our team was very excited about the crafting workshops, but we quickly found that we were equally excited about sharing dinner and making memories every night. A huge thank you to Ramesh, our dining room manager, for always making sure we were able to dine together and that we had a great time. We never missed catching our favorite entertainer, Micah, each night. Check out those moves. The first day of classes surpassed our expectations. Despite a few hiccups along the way, the experience was amazing. Before diving into the crafting, we took a moment to introduce ourselves and share a bit about our crafting journeys. Next, we were thrilled to give away some amazing door prizes provided by our generous sponsors, Iron Orchid Designs, Surebonder, HTV Ron, and Cricut. Then, Brandy and Kay took the helm. Kay kicked off the session by demonstrating how to craft a charming personalized sign, as well as showcasing the simplicity of creating a layered bow to adorn wreaths, highlighting just how easy these techniques can be. Next, Brandy took over and guided the attendees step-by-step step through the process of creating stunning mesh wreaths, sharing valuable tips and techniques along the way. We loved seeing the diversity and creativity as everyone put their own unique spin on their wreaths. Our first port day was in Nassau and was very laid back. We decided to skip the excursions and just enjoyed exploring the straw market and soaking up the island vibes. It was the perfect way of deepening friendships. That evening, we hosted a pink flamingo gift exchange, think white elephant with a crafty twist, we had so much fun and laughter and everyone agreed it has to become a tradition on future cruises. Our second port day took us to Half Moon Cay, where we tendered over to the island for a day of fun in the sun. Once on the island, we were met with a dreamlike scene of gentle waves, vibrant flowers, and a gorgeous beach set against the endless aqua blue horizon. It was like stepping into a postcard. Kendra had the brilliant idea to do some crafting right there on the beach, and that added an extra special touch to our day in paradise. Back on the ship for our final sea day, Kendra led us through a workshop where she shared her expertise on using spindles to craft a charming mini wreath holder, as well as how to make an adorable mini grapevine wreath. And then she wowed us with how to make finger bows. In the final session, Trish guided us through a step-by-step -step tutorial on crafting wood round signs and demonstrated her technique for making faux shitlap. Then she demonstrated yet another technique for crafting bows to enhance your projects. It was amazing to see everyone's creativity in action. The amazing friends that joined us on our first crafty cruise included mothers and daughters, couples, sisters, cousins, and best friends. No need to worry if you came to class without a crew. The atmosphere was so welcoming and friendships were formed that will last a lifetime. 
A big thank you goes out to our new friends, Susan and her husband, Richard, for capturing all of those precious moments throughout the trip. As a bonus, they told us that they enjoyed the cruise so much, they booked next year's cruise before they even left Florida. If you would like to join us for all the fun in 2025, check out the link below to secure your spot. We can't wait to embark on yet another crafting adventure, making memories with old and new friends alike. See you on board in 2025.